Uh, let's see here. Three eighty one. Yeah, if it's higher than your current gear, man, pop it on and um, won't hurt. I'll pop it on, but... I'm up to 379. Oh, so close. Barrix has brought unsaving The devil splices have been seeming to resurrect things. an old foe. Tenex the Scarred has become Tenex Perfected. Asshole. Tenex's it's crew so has joined the splicers. They're using Seba oh, to reanimate perfected. his body and overtake his territory. You've got another key, don't you? Lord yes, I do. You were I got one key left. You get the most glorious. We you get the most glorious cloak from this. I'll um, I'll put it on so you can see it when we load in. It is fabulous. It's got like a big fur neck lining on it and stuff. But yeah, there's hunter gear at the end of it, so... Actually, this is the... It's always good. This is what the Night Raid uh, strike was last week. Was Tanix perfected. Yeah, the Nightfall. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yep, I forgot to, uh... Scouts report that the Splicers are capturing local high for experimentation. And forgot to pop the three coins. Uh oh. Oh god. Oh. I was in menu. Just keep running. I'll catch up. There's a trick to this strike. If you can run past. Like down the slope and you don't jump, the shriekers don't activate. Yeah, that's what I did. I, because <laughs> that's what the guys told me the last time. As long as you don't jump, the uh, shriekers yeah. won't go after you. Surprisingly, I wasn't the first one to die. Yeah. Oh, my God. So many hundred ones now. There's a nugget there. I'm not having a good run. That other guy's still back, they're just kind of killing like stuff. Looks like ship is intact. Get on the <laughs> lift.
was more machine than we thought. He's not alive. Perhaps he never was. Tanix, as he just kind of spawns on top of me. Yeah, you left. Oh, he's got a solar panel today. That's not bad. Yeah, thank you, sir. Oh, that was totally worth it. Captain came running at me, the only thing I had to reload with was my rocket launcher. I said what it was. He's all the way down the back. All the way down there. Down there. Down there. Yeah, my freaking my heavy machine gun is solar, so it's putting out some serious damage on him. Nice. Hey, right, he's run away finally. Except I'm out of ammo for everything except my primary. <laughs> <laughs> That boss fight with it not knowing what's around you, it's gonna hurt. Yeah, this is the uh, the damn splicer splicer tank. Yeah. Well, the splicer tank itself isn't too bad, but that final fight with panics when you can't see what's around you is um. Oh yeah. Because everything just kind of drops in wherever. Yeah, there's no like, they don't come through certain doors. It's moderately random. Wow. Of course he dies all the way down. Yeah. <laughs> Brilliant. Ouch, no, maybe not. There's exploders. Yo. Snuck up on me. I got you. Alright, now where's this guy? Was he trying to hug it? I, think he was. I have no idea. I just got molested again. Oh, he came back here, which is nice. Oh my god. No, maybe not. There we go. I'm 
and takes care of the snipers at least. Almost. Okay. Hey! There we go. Celestial Nighthawk. If you ever get that as a gunslinger, if you ever get that helmet, man, use it. it is, especially with like solar burn damage, it is absolutely brutal. So basically, what it does is it condenses every single one of your golden gun shots into a singular shot and ups the damage. So it's literally like a cannon. Yeah, it, it becomes less of a golden gun and more of a golden cannon. some heavy ammo. I'm in desperate need of heavy ammo. Hey. Oh, hey, there's some more. Okay. Got him. All right. Exotic thing going. I remember. Got it. Entirely wiping the whole way, and there's something wrong with us. Yeah, I know. I just like wasted my freaking golden gun. Oh man. Oh, nope. That wasn't gonna happen. Survive, dude, survive. Oh, that was cool. Oh, no. Alright, he can hold out eight seconds. I can get myself up. Oh, right. Right behind tanks. Go ahead. Yeah, I was waiting for that dude to respawn me so I could get my freaking Telesto on that group of guys. Yeah. Where is he? Oh, yeah, he's behind me.
How is there so many server towers? Oh my. No! I've got, I've got chart. Can I stick in danger or what? Really missing one. Man, these guys are like never ending. They just keep spawning through the door. Mm-hmm. Oh! I see it with Golden Dawning. Oh god! Yeah. These damn exploders. Oh what? Oh god. Hurry up, dude. Get somebody. Oh my god. That is a cluster. I'm up top. I'm behind cover, but... No! Oh, damn. Oh, no. He got up just in time. Oh, my God. That was a hell of a lot. He needs to, <laughs> he needs to do yet? something quick. Thankfully, I'm behind cover, but he needs to hurry up. He's going to do anything. Um, what's your countdown on I'm good. Right. And I'm on. Oh, we pulled that one from somewhere. Golden gun if you've got it, not mission. Nope, I don't have my golden gun. So I got him. I have oh we got him. from restarting Tanix's mercenary operation. The Nanites continue to evolve their function. Chest is over here if you want it. plenty of opportunities to study Siva. Yeah, why not? The devils are far from defeated. Cloak of Tanix. <gasps> Cloak. All right, so two chests, two cloaks. Not bad. Not bad. How are the blues treating you? Any better ones there? Uh, still 381. Nah. Is it higher than you think you've got wearing, or is it? Well, I do have I do have a bunch that I now. didn't get. Uh, I need to go back to the tower and get some stuff uh, unencrypted. Yeah. Um, good plan. And my inventory is kind of full at the moment too. The Taken King is dead. Yet still his armies writhe and claw at our worlds. Even as you led the assault on the Dreadnought, a powerful Taken war beast fled for the safety of the shrine to Oryx. The would-be Prince Malak works to perfect a dark sorcery. He must be destroyed. Yeah, Bob? Give me a sec, man.
Yeah, that was an epic fail on my part. <laughs> I went to revive that guy and fell into the pit. Okay, that melee didn't hit. That's cool. At least you have another shot of that helmet now. Does that only... Does that drop from Malik? Yeah. Anybody home? The door is sealed with runes. Let's get to work. Wow. <laughs> Holy crap. What a throw? I don't know what the hell it was. Oh, that other guy left. Yeah. You don't even have to aim the throw. Great. I saw that jump. Oh, hey, there's a, an ogre in there this time. There was.
Legend hinted at secret pathways between our realm and the Ascendant. Malak crawled through the wall of our world to reach these caverns. I think she's just being deliberately creepy now. Damn snipers. Yeah. I love crawling into their bubble and throwing a grenade at their feet. <laughs> yeah, it's fun to do. Ah, uh, Hercules is miles off. Oh yeah. He fell off the edge. Or maybe not. No, he's... going a totally different way. I oh. think he got lost. That's alright. I'll drag him through in a bit. Light, Guardian. Locke's power is absolute here. The Blight is the black goo, right? What is that stuff anyway? Darkness, given form by Malak's cruel will. Oh, man. Cap didn't get you? No, it was a sniper. Oh, no. He spawned right on a pillar behind me. Shot me in the back like the coward he is. Son of a bitch.
Oh, I missed. I got a skeleton key. Again. That's the house. Hopefully. Oh, okay. I got the cloak of tech, tech more, and the hood of Malak. Nice. Cloaks for days in these chests. What's that? It's like cloaks for days. Yeah, I know. Every chest, every chest I went to, I got a cloak. All right, I think I'm ready to head back to the tower. Yeah, I was gonna say I might have to. Um, I might have to finish up shortly. Go and get some kind of average sleep. Next weekend's easier because it's a long weekend. I don't have a lot to do. But, um, this week I've got, like, um, graduation in town and stuff, so I'm flat out, which is fun. Well, I appreciate you helping me again. That's right, man. That's at any time. It's not mine at all. It's, it's fun having someone to play with that plays regularly again. I mean, get you up a few more light, man. We can probably go LFG Adventure the Raid. That's what I'm so. hoping for. I'm hoping to get at least some items that are, yeah. you know, half decent. Well, what will happen is the first, the first boss fight you do, if you do the challenge modes, 400 light items will drop automatically. Or drop a, they should drop at 400 light. So that'll boost you up heaps. Yeah, that's how it was with the... Uh, like when I picked up the 380 stuff. Like when I picked up the ghost with 380 and... I forget what else I got that had 380. But as soon as I infused those into my items, it was like everything was dropping at 380. So... Yeah. Slayer of Oryx, then? Yeah, that's your comeback. Tell me how this works for you. Oh, Postmaster has something for me. What would it be? Probably blues. Yep. Use it. Can't pick them up, though. Make sure you check in those blues when they drop, man. 
because then if you, even if you put them on while you decrypt, the other stuff will decrypt higher. Yeah, everything everything is three eighty one. Oh wait, three eighty three for my uh, gauntlets. Oh, that's that's handy. Oh, nice! I got the original scarf. All right, still at three seventy nine. Yep, got three eighty three for boots. It's a good start. Boom, there we go, 380. Beautiful. What was that, 380 and four strikes? Gotta empty all this crap out. in the vault for my warlock. Ooh, I have a bunch of those to put into memories. All right, so I'm at 381. Oh, excellent. That's what you want. Getting up heaps fast. Oh, that's pretty. Defense, drop gun, auto rifle, that's usual. Uh, what level are you on, um... 
Oh, actually, have you chosen a faction, or are you still with um just the Vanguard? No, I'm still with the Future War Cult. Future War Cult. Yeah. What rank? You, how how close to you are a rank on that? Um. I am about halfway to rank three. How many moats of light have you got? What was that? How many moats of light do you have? Um, I have... As soon as it'll load. Uh, 139. Let's go get... What rank are you on FWC? Like, rank 2 or 3? Yeah, I'm, I'm halfway to... Halfway to rank 3. Vex encryption. Let's go get you some stuff. Because you can use Motes of Light to boost up, um... Reputation. And they'll drop gear up to... 390 or 400 I think when you do a rank up package and you can choose weapons or armor the usual stuff so it should be I can't remember what it is on a package on the left hand side you'll see oh yeah and just yeah five modes of life for rank up Uh, that gets me a hundred. For five modes of light, it gets me a hundred um, faction experience. Yeah, I think it's about twenty or so should get you through a rank, roughly. Good. All right. Um, I don't know. What do you think I should take? Armor. Uh, what's your lowest um? What's your lowest thing at the moment? Um. Like what's holding you back? I mean, every everything is pretty pretty rounded. I mean, three eighty one to three eighty three is what my what everything is. Yeah. But what's at three eighty one then? You you should get a, a at least a ghost out of it or another hook another cloak well my an um, my angel's advocate is only at 381 my telesto is at 382 um my helmet is at 381 my gauntlets are at 383 vest is at 382 boots are at 383 so my armor is pretty pretty much at 383 because my cloak is at 383 as well yeah uh we'll go for a weapon then and um see what you get because the future war call has some halfway decent weapons as well all right give me something good please all right so i got the war the wormwood sidearm they're not bad for pvp uh, let me see i did get, i did get a ghost did as it? well uh 381 It's not really worth infusing though, because it's only one. It's only one more than what my current ghost has. I'll just switch it out for when you um when you trade stuff in, and then switch it back when when you're done with encrypting and stuff. That's what I usually do when I was grinding up. If even if you I, if you didn't normally wear it, just switch out just for encrypting, and then get the highlight stuff and then come back. What you originally had on. Oh, what what did your um wormwood come in at? Uh, three eighty three, which is only one better than my Telesto. Telesto, yeah.
Oh, can I hand that in? I think I have a... Uh, I have a weapon package for, to pick up. Oh, nice. I forgot I placed that order with the, the gun merchant. Oh, yeah. They drop at 385 too, don't they? Um, I don't know. I was at I was at too low of a lower. level <laughs> last time I got one. Oh, right. Fair enough. I think the last one I got dropped at like 350. Oh, yep. Yeah. That's about right. Let's get you back out there. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's not worth it. it. How's that feel? <laughs> it only dropped at 320. Oh god. Well, free legendary marks. It's been a while since I've. Yeah, that's it. Oh, there's a dead ghost up here, too, in this tree. There's a new one. They added more? We have some yeah, they add more every update. Well, back to the fight. The best way to come up here is up this way. That's it. Just keep climbing up and you'll see it. Yeah, I got it. Oh, wait, there's one more thing you have to get. I don't think you might, you might not have got it. Another sparrow. Another sparrow? Wait, oh, no, wait. No, actually, you might not be able to get it. Um, there's a, that's right. Yeah, there's a ghost on um, there's a ghost on the Bannerfall map you can go and collect. Um, and it unlocks this um, where is it? Where is? Unlocks a ghost you can pick up. I think it's down up here. Uh, a sparrow, rather. Called Lysander's Cry, and it's bright green. I don't remember where it is. I'm useless. But yeah, there's a ghost on the banner format you can get, and it gives you like it leads you back. Like, once you get that, you can get a sparrow. Oh, not down there. I can't remember where it's hidden. A little package thing. Shoulder to the wheel. Look windward. No, I can't see. Oh, it's, it's up here normally. I think it's here when you've got this. When you get when you get the dead ghost. Um, it's on the banner four map. I have to take you and do that later. Another day maybe. Yeah, well, at least I got up to three eighty. Yeah, yeah, you you you've got that last gap, man. Like. Because the raids are only the the new raids are only rated at all the raids are rated at three ninety, so you're at a pretty like you struggle through the first bit, but as long as you play smart, I was taking um my other friend through at three eighty two, three eighty three. You know he held his own quite well, so as long as you play smart and just kind of manage your health, because with the heroic raids, there's no revives. Until the encounter finishes. Right. So once you die, you're, you're down for the count until either everyone wipes and you start again. Or, um... The encounter finishes. Oh, I got packages apparently as well. Hey! More chances at going up. The heck is that? Husk of the pit? Oh, oh, pick that up. That is, um, that will lead you on another exotic quest. For a gun called the Necrochasm. Interesting. So what you have to do for that one, if you inspect the weapon, um, 
and you go into like its perks and stuff you'll see there's no real perks there's like kinetic damage and then there's a thing that says go and kill whatever type of types of enemies yeah and you have to do it with that weapon yeah it says cannibalism so you go do that and then yep so you go do that and then you bring it back to Eris Morn and it gives you she gives you another another quest with it and gives you a legendary version of it then you've got to go do stuff with that and then you've got to go do I think it's like the Omnigal Strike um the first and then a couple of parts of the um raid with Crota and it gives you an exotic that will drop at 400 nice should drop at 400 can't believe that went to your postmaster that's amazing that was there I didn't think they did because <laughs> huh. they dropped from ogres Oh, um, nice. I just got um, a, a helmet at 385. Oh, excellent. Excellent. That's what you want. Oh, I only have one exotic shard Go left. The... You can buy them from Zer if you need them. Alright, now I'm up to 382. Oh, that was a fast jump. Wow. That put you up really fast. Um, tell me. On your little... You should be able to hover over your, your light level. Uh-huh. And it will tell you how far... How or how close to the next light level you are? Are you like just on it? Yeah, I'm. I'm just. Or are you I'm like just, halfway up? It? No, I'm just half. I'm like just a little smidget over, into three eighty two. So yeah, I'll s s switch out your ghost uh, for that higher light one you've got, and that'll push you up just a little bit more. Yeah, it pushed me up. Yeah. And all the, those little bits count. Yeah. As well. But yeah, 382. There you go. What was that? Four or five levels tonight? Uh, yeah, it was at 377. That's good to work. Yeah. There you go. So yeah, five. Uh, without the um. So yeah, that works for me. Yeah. That's that's brilliant. But even if you, I don't know what you're up to today, but if you if you ran a few more strikes, you'd be pretty you'd be sitting pretty pretty well then come on guardian give us a challenge um yeah i think i'll be on i'll probably be on about all this time in 24 hours most likely all right um it'll be it'll be my friday tomorrow so I'll see so. you around Oh yeah, I'll be on probably. Yeah, well, wait, I is, won't be on all weekend, Friday? but it is Friday. But what the fuck? Oh, it's Friday now. Yeah, yeah, I'll be on all weekend too, man. But um, yeah, it's Friday for you. It's on... still Thursday for me. Yeah, it's Friday for me. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's only just Friday by like an hour. <laughs> um, but um, my Saturday, which is what your Saturday day, I think, um, around. The time I was on before, um, I should be raiding with um, my friend Color, and we can. If, if you're up and about, man, um, yeah, definitely. Let me know. I've yet to do we'll, any raids, we'll get so you in and, and we'll get you into the the best raid, which is the Vault of Glass one. So I can't promise I'll be effective. He, I think he's but... only about three eighty seven. That's what I mean. It's all about learning. You've got to learn. Because what we'll do is we'll go into the LFG post. Um, we'll put up. Um, and we'll look for three other people. To say yeah, we're teaching people. Um, have been through the raid before. Most people are usually pretty chill about it. Like if you're helping teach someone, they'll um, they like you. You get some pretty good people in. They'll pitch in to help out and stuff. And we can get you through one. All right. Sounds good. Uh, no worries, man. I'll um, catch you soon. All right, man. Later. Thanks for helping. All right. Later. No problem. Anytime.
Alright guys, so I'm going to end the episode here. It was a very long episode, so it's definitely going to be a two-part episode. Um, but again, thank you to Deft Puppies for helping me out to reach my goal of 380 light. Which was achieved, as well as doing some Siva strikes and opening some, uh, opening some chests. Strike chests. So lots of new stuff experienced today. And I appreciate it. And hopefully, I uh, hear... Within the next day or so, I can do some raids with him. Would be amazing. So thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed this episode, or these episodes, I should say, uh, please hit the like button. If you guys enjoy my Let's Plays, please don't hesitate to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in uh, the next episode of Let's Play Destiny Blind. But until then, guys, later.